Hi, I'm here with Sam Altman, CEO of OpenAI. Uh, today, we are very excited to announce a strategic partnership with OpenAI, and I have thought it would be a great chance for us to chat about uh, OpenAI and your uh, progress towards this generalized uh, learning in AGI. Uh, so, Sam, welcome. Thank you very much. Uh, maybe we can start right uh, with OpenAI and its mission yeah. um, and uh, the opportunity. So our mission is to develop artificial general intelligence, uh, broad AI systems that can do a lot of tasks at superhuman level, and then figure out how to deploy those systems in the way that it most benefits the world. Uh, I think this will be the most important technological development in human history. Uh, when we have computers that can really think and learn, uh, that's going to be transformative, and we want to figure out how to be on the, the leading edge of that and figure out how to have the maximum positive impact with it. That's right. Scale from today's sort of narrow domains of uh, AI yeah. to really a generalized learning. You know, today what we have are sort of systems that are maybe like one small region of the brain that can do one task well. And as we scale these systems up and up and up, and as we make algorithmic innovations and figure out better training environments, uh, we're already starting to see this. We get systems that are quite general in their power. And then, of course, Central to this partnership is uh, really your ambition around this generalized uh, AI as well as the supercomputer in some yes. sense that's required. And yes. you've been working with Azure in the past. Uh, we've you know, shared with you our roadmap. You know, talk about sort of the nature of uh, AI itself becoming much more compute bound and the need for computational power for you know, pursuit of your mission. So we started back with Azure in 2016. One of the things that we've learned since then is, uh, and this is a reason for great optimism, is that uh, increasing the size of the largest models we can train uh, keeps letting us solve seemingly impossible tasks. So we have been incredibly hungry for larger and larger neural networks that we can train faster and faster. As we started to really learn this and really believe it, uh, that this 8x increased per year for the last seven years, and wanted to make sure we keep that curve going, right. uh, we got to see you know everybody's plans. We met all the custom chip companies, and uh, yeah, We've seen the Azure roadmap. We think we're going to keep getting that 8x. And our belief is that by far, um, Azure will have the best solution for training these super, super large models. Um, and we're thankful you guys are willing to take some input from us and work together. And yeah, absolutely. And one of the things that both of our organizations care deeply about is AI safety. Yes. Um, and so how, how do you, you at OpenAI thinking about this? So I think technology, the technology industry in the last few years has not done a good enough job about thinking ahead of time about the impact that their work is going to have. And so we want to make sure uh, is that the systems that we build are safe, they're understandable, uh, and most importantly, uh, the benefits of it are broadly shared. We always talk about how do we how we want to democratize AI. To us, it's all about how can AI be that new source of productivity and surplus creation all around the world. There are a lot of reasons I'm excited about this partnership, but at the top of the list is how you think about what it really means to be a technology platform and, and democratizing access. We are very, very excited about this roadmap I had. And so I'm optimistic, both in terms of our ability to build the supercomputer and the AGI on top of it. But most importantly, what excites me is the opportunity the two organizations have because of the core mission we share uh, to have that broad impact where we truly democratize access to a AI and AGI uh, to every organization out there to be able to really take advantage of it. So thank you very much, Sam. It's great to have you. Thank you for the partnership. Thanks.